Okay, so I'm gonna make this video here about the Porsche Cayenne 2003 to 2006 uh, headlight assembly. There's one I just finished right there. I'm kind of rebuilding them. Uh, this is the HID version, Xenon bulb, which goes right here. Uh, this also is adjustable. You can see right here, this part goes up and down to adjust. I don't have any knowledge about the non-HID one, so I can't tell you if they have that or not. But I had learned the hard way how to install the adjuster. So the adjuster goes right here. There's a screw hole there, screw hole there, and then that thing back there is very important. Had I known that before I put my headlights in the other night, I would have um, not messed up because when we left the drive in, um, the uh, headlights were pointing downward um, and we had to drive 40 miles with uh, yeah headlights like looking like fog lights so that's because that wasn't this little ball here was not attached to that back end so what this does let me go out here and forgive me for my crude video here it's just a handheld, it's just my cell phone, so. But I wanna make this, because I, I don't wanna make somebody else go through the same thing I did. So what you wanna do is, when you have, there's the adjuster. Uh, each side has its own unique uh, plastic piece, this part right here. Okay, so this one's for the driver's side, and it's gonna match this side when you put it in like this. Okay, those little nodules right here, are going to go in the holes around there's the bottom one there see that one right there next to the where the screw goes and the other one's going to go right there in that hole where that right here okay and then the other one is going to go right above i'm sorry right beside the screw right here see it so this one has to go in the hole this one will slip up this one will slip up and then it should line the screw holes and go in but first you have to get that right there this, this ball right here has to go in that thing how do you do that this is where i screwed up when i put them in the first time this is why my lights didn't work the other night and they were aiming down it's called dipping what you want to do is take this and you just want to push it downward towards you so this comes closest to you. Then you want to screw this out, okay? So it gets longer, longer. So it does shorten up. This is what this does is moves back and forth. See how it gets shorter? So you want to move this all the way out, okay? And when you do that, that's going to prevent you from, or not prevent you, but allow you to then slip that from the bottom up where it locks in and then you can then put this plastic housing in its proper place so it's going to be hard for me to do this holding the phone let me see if i can back it up a little bit it's gonna be hard for me to do this holding the phone and making this video at the same time get this wire out of here so um but basically what you're going to do is go in here like this, line up, and again, I, I probably won't be able to get in there. Line this up and go up from the bottom, okay? I'm not gonna be able to do this one hand. Take this, push it forward. It's gonna go in that nodule, or that, what would you call that? Little sleeve right there. It'll lock in place. It will slip out still, okay? So it's not gonna just stay there. And then you're going to want to line up this plastic housing. There's one, two, three. Okay, and you have three places for that go. One, two, and three. And those screw holes should line up. If you do that properly, this is in. That screw right there goes with that. Not screw, whatever you call those things. 
and then those holes should line up. It might take you two or three times to get it just right. But once you do and you screw that in there, you're gonna notice that that thing is now attached. And when you put your lights in, your headlight adjusters will work. If you just throw it on there, just take, boom, do it, screw it in, and it's not attached to that back, guess what's gonna happen? You're gonna get a warning, it's gonna say dipping. Headlight dipping. And trust me, when you have to drive 40 miles from a drive-in, in the dark and your both headlights are dipping and you can't see past 20 feet in front of you you fix it or you learn how to fix it real quick so i hope that helps again sorry for the crude videotaping i'm not a pro at this but i just felt it was necessary to make this because i didn't think anybody else had anything like this on uh, on uh, online so good good, good luck to you